Right, thank you, Ed. There are some groups around the country now, including some here at home, that are demanding their local governments defund their police departments. In Buffalo, almost 20% of the city's $519 million budget goes to the police department. The new spending proposal on the books right now includes $86 million for the BPD. That's down about $3 million from the current budget that's in effect right now. Tonight, our I-Team Chief Investigator Charlie Specht takes a closer look at the numbers and how that taxpayer money is being used here. Protesters in Buffalo say they want more than just police reform. They want the Buffalo Common Council to defund the police. Buffalo lawmakers brushed off those suggestions last week when they passed the department's $86 million budget. So we dug into that budget to see what your money is paying for. 86% of the police budget is used on the public safety category. 12% of the budget goes toward administration, and less than 2% goes for fleet and building maintenance. This may surprise you, the Buffalo Police Department employs more than 1,000 people, including nearly 800 officers and police brass. The rest are civilian employees like mechanics and clerical workers. The budget also sheds light on what those employees do. Each year, Buffalo Police respond to about 205,000 calls to 911. Officers make between 12 and 13,000 arrests and investigate roughly 50 murders each year. The men and women of the BPD also make about 365 drug-related arrests, an average of one per day. The recently passed $86 million BPD budget is actually $3 million less than this year. Charlie Speck, 7 Eyewitness News.